So we're here in the Maldives and it's August 2016, filming for Animated Science and we're looking at hermit crabs today. So I've been out and in this bucket we've been, uh, we've actually got a few mollusks as well but there's mainly hermit crabs and they're just on the edge of the water. So just sort of in the, uh, in the trees, hiding in the roots during the day and they feed on detritus. Now they're going to move pretty quick when I drop them out of the bucket. Um, and I'll just say as well, although I've taken them out of their natural environment, they are in salt water here and they do breathe air. So what they're going to do is they're going to, in a minute, they're going to start scurrying off, disappearing off into the water again or hiding back in those trees because if I point that way, there are some trees in that direction. So here we go, let's have a look and see what, what we get. So, a bit of water out. Just try and be careful not to get nipped because they're pretty big, these fellas. So we'll chuck them all out. Let's see what happens. Let's go in a little bit. We'll see what they're doing. So there they are. They're all different sizes, these little guys. So this one, this red one here, let's just go up a little. He's busy getting out, isn't he? Straight away. He's going for it. Yeah, he's a really big one. The others are making their way out the other sides. We zoom in a little. Let's try and get him. He's crawling up the sand pretty fast, this one. Let's go in a little bit more, try and see him. Amazing creatures. So you can see arthropod, exoskeleton. They've got uh, eye stalks, haven't they? Give a little touch, just push him back down. Seems a bit cruel. See if he can crawl up again. There we are. Oh. We'll let him go this second time. See how far he gets. Sort of going up the pit. Try and zoom in a little bit more. Let's see. Oh, there. Come out there. You can see his eyes clearly, can't you? own shell. So unlike some creatures like crabs where they grow a shell and, and then they shed it or a prawn which is a crustacea isn't it as well and they grow it, an exoskeleton a shell and then they shed it and if you, you keep maybe a bamboo shrimp in your tank you would know this because you see the shell in the tank. But all these crabs in fact have stolen their shells. They're not their shells at all. They're other people's shells. So you've got mollusk shells and all sorts in there and actually from time to time hermit crabs fight over their shells but in the end the biggest crab wins and these guys are really moving now they're very fast but the second you touch them they're quite clever the second you put your finger near them so let's try this guy here and just touch him on his shell he stops he moves in this guy though he's a bit more aggressive we try to let's go down to this little one down here See if I can capture this one, it's, it's movement. Touch it, look, oh, it goes back in, curls up. Now the problem is, some of them, so like this one here, if you look, he's actually, we're going a bit far, his, his legs are sticking out. That shell is outgrown, so he needs a new shell. So at some point soon, he's going to be fighting somebody for a new shell. Put it back in that one. Give him another go. That big one at the top, let's go back to him. Or it could be a. I don't really know. That one's made it out to freedom. So let's pull out and we we'll see. There's another one up there. A little bit further, can you see? He's made it all the way out there. Our little man made trap was no problem. There you go. Right in the distance. Going. He's off and he's gone. Now that the 
there's something else we can have a look at as well. Now the mollusks that I picked up. Now then, let's see if we can uh, come right out a second. And we'll see what happens with the mollusks. Hold on. I'm just going to get that. Those little guys. I'm just going to move. Look in there, they're all climbing out the out the bucket. Now that shell, that is their shell. If you notice all the shells for these snails, they're all similar shells. Because they all make their shell. If we're going close here, you can see, oh he's made it out. Oh, we dropped him on the sand. Let's put him back in. See if one of the others wants to come out a little bit. Let's take him out. Just bring him up a little. You can see his foot there, can't you? That single foot that he uses, what it uses. And look, the tendril comes out, he's feeling. He's trying to have a look to see where he's going. Oh, just trying to. There we go, look. An amazing creature two stalks. So I think it's about time to allow these guys back to where they want to go. Now the snails they like the water so we're going to make sure that they go back in the water and the crabs we're just going to let them run off all on their own. So that's a video for animated science in Maldives.